Welcome to the fourth lesson of Power Query. In this tutorial, we will be learning how do you change the text. Like if you get a text in capital letter and if you want to convert first character into the capital or if you want to convert everything in small character, how do we do that? So normally in Excel, we do with the help of upper, lower and proper formula. Here, without using a formula, we can use a power query to do that. So let's see how do we do that. The first step is I will click on any of the cell over here and then I will go to the data tab and here I will click on from table range. If you remember our previous video that was lesson number two in which we have already combined first name and last name. But now the problem is over here somewhere you have capital, somewhere you have small, somewhere again you have both the character capital, here you have Yatin as capital. So I wanted to clean it. So how do we clean this? So I will go to the data tab and I will click on from table range and my power query editor will open. So here remember. In the second lesson we had seen of the combining so over here this one we had already combined okay so now what we will be doing is we will be selecting this column and I wanted to convert it into the small letters or first letter capital so I will go to the transform tab this is a transform tab I will go to the format over here and you get different types of cases lower upper and capitalized each word can you recall if this options are there in Excel no it's not there you have to use a formula for that yes in MS Word it's present but in Excel you have to use a formula but here in Power Query it's ready so as soon as I click on capitalized each word your first character will become capital Wow and over here he has repeated that step name also that you have done capitalized each word step got it so now what will be the next step I have to exit from here but here you will see something new and I will explain you about that you have to little bit understand that concept I click on a file and I say close and load now friends when I click on close and load what it is going to do is it is going to create a separate sheet that is table number two and he has created a separate query so actually what it should have done he should have updated in my table one only agree so why it happened because I went to the data and again I clicked on this Whereas actually what I should have done is I should have come on my this query and I should have said edit this I will show you in the next video how this concept works however in this video even if you have learned that how do you convert your capital to small small to capital that is sufficient thank you so much and see you in the next video.